Let's try using our knowledge of completing the square to solve this quadratic equation. Now, we want the left-hand side of the equation to contain a square, so that way we can take the square root of both sides. In other words, our goal is to make the left side look like a perfect square, and the right side to be some sort of number. Then we could use our square root method that we learned before to continue solving. First, let's move this positive 7 to the other side of the equation. We do this so we can start working towards getting a perfect square trinomial on the left, and a number on the right. Now that we're here, we want to add some amount to both sides of our equation. Remember, we can only perform the same operation to the left-hand side of the equation and the right-hand side of the equation in order for our equation to remain balanced. So what amount will we have to add here to complete the square? And since we add this amount here, remember we'll add the same amount on the right. 